Salespeople, sales managers, and business managers, it's Memorial Day weekend, and this is your sales meeting for Memorial Day weekend. Here we go. Let's focus on vehicle selection. Vehicle selection controls the inventory, and more, more importantly, controls gross profit, so let's focus on it this weekend. During the needs analysis, let's ask them about equipment. Now let's remember, customers today do so much investigation, they already know what they want in the vehicle. So let's just ask them a simple question. As far as the equipment is concerned, what were you hoping for in your new vehicle? Whatever the customer mentions, that's great, but if they do not mention any particular piece of equipment, do not ask if they want it. If they don't say 22 inch wheels, leather interior, sunroof, convertible, hot rodded motor, better suspension, spoiler, if they don't say it, do not ask. If they say it, that's what's important to them. Next big piece is budget. Ask the customer where they are in their current vehicle. Something simple like this. What are you currently paying on the vehicle that you're driving now? Customer's gonna give an answer. From there, we ask them a follow-up question. Great, in addition to that, what do you have budgeted for your new vehicle? Subconsciously, we're telling the customer it's going to be more expensive and they're gonna give us a number. If they wanna keep about the same payment, we need to properly educate the customer that, you know what, to have the same payment, we need to buy about the same amount of vehicle. Now, how do we determine the budget from there? They gave us a number and let's say it's $400 a month. How much vehicle do we put them on? Take that 400, multiply it by five, add a zero, start at a $20,000 vehicle, and that could be the uh, internet advertised price, it could be MSRP minus rebate, it could be uh, the pre-owned price, but that's the starting price. Stop getting yourself tangled up where they say $400 a month and we end up showing the customer a $35,000, $40,000 vehicle because that's what they want to look at. They've done their investigation, but when you start showing them that more expensive vehicle, in the customer's brain, they're thinking, well, wait a second, I told the salesperson I wanted to be at this budget and they're showing me this vehicle, they must know a way to do it. And it ends up not working very well. We end up into long negotiations, tremendously extended terms, nobody's making any money, the customer is aggravated, the customer experience goes down. The customer did their research. Let's embrace their research, put them onto the right vehicle, have a great Memorial Day, maximize our profitability, CSI, and a great customer experience. From everyone here at the Academy, I'm Tony D. I'll see you next week.